Welcome to Film Crux, I'm Lion Elton. Today we're gonna to teach you 13 creative editing tricks to make unbelievable videos that stand out from the crowd with a surprisingly mind-blowing video editor that's easily the most underrated software out there, CapCut on desktop. You're not gonna believe what you can do with this, and the best part is, it's free. Let's go. This trick is gonna blow your mind. If you wanna do a quick color grade and change the entire look of your scene without messing up your character's skin tones, just select the clip, go to adjustment, and under basic, select skin tone protection. Then no matter how intense your color grade, CapCut will automatically preserve your subject's skin tones so you get amazing looking images without even trying. If you have a video you wanna use, but it's noisy and grainy because it was shot in bad lighting, you can try one click noise reduction. Just select your clip and under video, go to basic and click noise reduction. Just like that, CapCut will clean up your image and remove a lot of the noise for you. As a bonus, you can click on image enhancement to level up your quality even more. One great way to add a ton of visual interest is to do a faux dolly zoom. A dolly zoom is when you dolly in while zooming out, or vice versa. You can do this digitally to create essentially the same effect much easier. Take any smooth shot of the camera tracking backwards away from your subject. Set a keyframe on the scale at the beginning of the clip, then go to the end of the clip and zoom in by increasing the scale so that the subject is the same size at the end of the clip as they were in the beginning. This creates a wildly dramatic effect and you can do the same thing in reverse by taking a tracking in shot and zooming out. Nothing's more tedious than adding captions, but since 50% of people look at videos on their phone with the sound off, you can use CapCut to add auto captions without wasting any time. Just select text in the top left of your screen and click auto captions, then just select the language and CapCut will automatically caption your video for you. Then you can just make any small corrections, adjust settings to taste, and add any effects you like to your captions with the click of a button. Most programs have useless, outdated effects that you would never use, so you end up making them yourself or having to use third-party plugins. CapCut actually has a ton of effects that are surprisingly good, from insanely useful ones like their transitions and text animation effects, to just plain cool like their wild voice effects. The synth voice effect alone is way too fun not to use. CapCut's known for their transitions, but on the desktop version you can do even more. Just click on your first clip, go to the animation settings, and select an out animation, which will play at the end of this clip. Then click on your second clip and choose an in animation that goes well with the first one. This allows you to create an endless combination of custom transitions in seconds. Take shots of a single subject and mask out different sections, moving them to different parts of the screen. Then make the effect more dramatic by adding different special effects and color grading to each mask section to make them stand out and pop even more. If you want to add some extra flair to your edits, try animated letterboxes. Just go to your clip, click on the mask tab under video, and select film strip. Set a keyframe on size where you want the animation to start. Move to where you want the animation to end and drag the edges of your letterbox out of the screen. Play it back and you'll get this stunning cinematic look which is perfect for major moments of change in your edit. If you need an amazing thumbnail for your video but you want to save time, there's a trick to quickly make your thumbnail without actually leaving your edit. Just press this button beside your timeline that says click to edit cover and you can actually select the frame you want for your thumbnail, add title text and effects right there inside CapCut. One of the coolest visual tricks is cloning, or the masking technique. This can be done easily inside CapCut by using the auto cutout feature, which will remove your subject from the background. Just duplicate your clip and drag it above your original. Under video, go to cutout and select auto cutout. Then click and drag on that cutout to move it to where you want it to be. You can then duplicate that cutout layer as many times as you want and place the cutout anywhere in your scene to effortlessly create this amazing cloning effect. If you have an existing edit or series of clips that you need to cut, but you don't want to do it manually, just right click it and select split scene. CapCut will do it for you automatically in a matter of seconds. If you don't like the idea of doing the voiceovers for your own videos, or you just want to save time, you can use CapCut's surprisingly good text-to-speech. Most text-to-speech sounds robotic and unnatural, but CapCut has a lot of voices that are pretty impressive, especially the chill girl voice. Everything you need to make amazing films. You can actually remove all the pauses, repeats, and filler words like uh and um from your videos with the click of a button. Just select this scissor tool and a new pop-up window will appear with a transcript of your video. You can then just select which pauses, repeats, or filler words you want taken out, potentially saving you hours and hours of time, especially if you make a lot of videos. Most people are surprised that all these features are in the desktop version of CapCut and they keep adding new ones all the time. So go try them out yourself at the link in the description and make something amazing with them. We'll see you in the next one.